All right, Coach Jeremy, here we are. Sherman, Sherman Challenges, where are you out of? Uh, Omaha, Nebraska. Omaha, Nebraska. Day two, uh, Tulsa kickoff action. How's everything going? Everything's going good so far. A couple losses. Uh, we got a few in the quarters. Brought 10 down from uh, Nebraska, and uh, everybody's looking good so far. It's a tough tournament. How do you decide which kids out of your club are going to come down here? Or you just try to get them all? Uh, no, we don't try to get them all. We don't bring the ones, uh, the, the newer ones, but uh, the elite ones, the better ones. We've got a, we've got a few Trinity Award winners from our club. Oh, wow. And, uh, yeah, so we kind of picked through there. Through the, through so the let me, let me ask, ask you this. You said uh, you, know, you took a couple losses. A lot of people do down here. What do you say to your athletes after a loss, or does it depend on the match? How do you communicate with them? It, it depends on the match. We had a couple kids made some mistakes out there. We got yeah. a couple kids who hadn't had any matches yet, and this is actually their first tournament, so it's a rough one for it to be the first one. And, uh... So, you know, it depends on the match. You know, it's always a dog fight out here. Everything's uh, like a chess match. You know, yeah. we, we had some, like my son, he's a Trinity Award winner. He's won a, a two to zero match and a four to zero match. And he was the number two seed coming in. So, you know, you got to earn everything out here. Nothing's yeah. given. Says a lot about the competition. So, yeah. like you said, a lot, of, a lot of teams first event of the year. What are you trying to get out of this event? A learning experience. Yeah. Learning, uh, learning, teaching the kids to get to the next level. Mm -hmm. To learn to uh, wrestle on the next level. Get them ready for high school. Uh, you know, basically high school, college, and you know, Basically, that's it. Nice. Tell me a little bit about the club. Um, Sherman Challengers. We've been around about 20 years. Wow. <clears throat> we've got a. Uh, we've had a lot of national state champions. We actually got a kid uh, from our club. Just I got a full ride to Oklahoma State. Jason Burks. Oh. And, uh, man, yeah, he's a hammer. Yeah, he got a full ride here, and he's right from Sherman Challengers. And uh, so we've turned out a lot of good kids, a lot of good state champions. We've got several kids wrestling in college now. And, uh, yeah, I mean, we just grind. We get them from the bottom, you know, bring them up. We bring them up from the time they're three, four years old. And, you know, we're not into taking other people's wrestlers. We train them from the time they're babies cool. and bring them up and get them as rough as they can. It always works out for us so far. So why wrestling? Why you uh, invest energy into wrestling and help train these kids? It's the greatest sport in the world. Nice. nice. Any, uh, any predictions to NCAA season? NCAA? Oh man, it's always fireworks, man. It's yeah. always good to watch. Yeah, I'm, I'm waiting on Penn State, waiting on Mark Hall to see what he can do. I actually watched a lot of those kids wrestle down here uh -huh. over the years. You know, I watched them wrestle here in Tulsa, and I'm watching them wrestle on the collegiate level. So it's always fun to watch. We don't, from Nebraska, you know, we got JB, but other than that, we don't got a whole lot of, we've got some tough ones up there, but hey. yeah. Cool. Well, yeah, it's always fun looking back at brackets here and then seeing like several future, you know, guys that became All Americans, yeah. world team members and stuff. Awesome. Well, I appreciate it. Anything else you want to share with us? Uh, I'll go Sherman Challenges. You're the Let's man. All right. Thanks, Thanks. Jeremy.